A new kind of virtual reality is being described as revolutionary by experts. However, this time the technology isn't focused on video games, but the human heart. A doctor at Stanford has teamed up with the tech gurus in the Silicon Valley to create a virtual heart. As Shelley Botat tells us in Health Watch, the aim is not to just tell, but show patients' families what's happening inside the body. A virtual reality heart is helping families learn about the medical procedure that saved their loved one's life. Like most kids, Bailey Cox is in constant motion from one adventure to the next. So much so that few would ever guess that she suffers from a severe heart condition. Bailey uh, prenatally was diagnosed with a heart condition. We found out she um, had a heart defect in utero at a 3D ultrasound. So Bailey was born with hypoplastic left heart syndrome. The whole left side of the heart, the part of the heart that does the main pumping of blood out to the body, um, does not develop normally. So far, Bailey has had four open heart surgeries. It's been a roller coaster of emotions for her parents. We had no idea uh, about the intricacies of the heart. As a result, the Coxes received a crash course from Bailey's cardiologist, David Axelrod. Everything was drawn on a whiteboard or a piece of paper to explain it. That is until Dr. Axelrod devised a way to let patients step into their own heart. The Stanford Virtual Heart is a virtual reality experience um, that patients, families can use to understand um, both the normal heart and also congenital heart disease. Using a headset and handheld remote controls. We are able to see what the um, surgeries do, um, what's repaired and how the heart will actually function. I saw my heart, my first surgery, and my second surgery. My head's still spinning over it, really. Parents that look at it and, and, and immediately understand the three-dimensional aspect of the heart. It was pretty amazing. Bailey knows what matters the most. Special, and I take good care of it. Dr. Axelrod predicts in the next few years, every hospital in the U.S. will be using virtual reality in some way. In addition to patients, the technology is also being used to train medical students about the 3D aspect of the heart. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Shelley Botat, Local 5 News. Thank you, Shelley. The battle against addiction is now going high tech. See how one expert is treating addiction in a whole new realm. That's tomorrow in Health Watch.